I'm Rob Moody and we're here on the Matrox booth at ISE 2015 in Amsterdam and we're looking at the new Matrox C-Series cards. This is the first time they've been seen at an AV show in Europe so they're new for most of the visitors here. I hope you enjoy. The cards themselves are, uh, are based on the, on the third generation uh, PCI Express bus um, and they're following in the Matrox tradition of well-engineered cards, the high video, video quality and good picture, picture playback, video playback. The, in, involving the, the, the associated Matrox values of stability and reliability, the things that have made us popular with, uh, with users and integrators alike. And they incorporate the ease of use and the ease of deployment that make our, make our customers choose to come back to us again and again. We've got two cards here at the, uh, at the show. We've got the C420, which is a four output card, and the C680, which is a six output card. The C420 is low profile and it's fanless. And we're very proud to say that is the fastest low profile quad card in the world today. It's small form factor and it's um, power frugalness make it a very good uh, fit for small form factor PCs for signage players, embedded systems, and it's gonna find application across a wide variety of pro AV uh, um, scenarios, as well as in control rooms, ops rooms, and driving video walls. So signage players and multi-screen uh, multi workstations are the other, the other favorite applications for these cards. I mentioned it's a four output card. Each of those four outputs is capable of driving up to 4 megapixel. That's 2560 by 1600, which of course includes full HD. The outputs can be independent, they can be cloned, or they can be stretched across the whole output. So that's a nice big professional sized output with the latest DirectX and OpenGL hardware acceleration available behind that, uh, that desktop. C680 is the same, but more. You've got six outputs, that's 50% higher display density. You've, uh, um, you've got a higher resolution on, the, on those cards. Each of those six outputs goes right up to UHD or 4K resolutions. So with six outputs at 4K, that's a huge number of pixels on your desktop. But it gets better. The, uh, those, those cards have a board-to-board -board frame lock facility. That means you can have two cards in the same system and that the uh, content across that 12 uh, output display will be synchronized and still have the OpenGL and the, and the latest DirectX acceleration behind it. So that's a, that's a really powerful uh, um, card combination. Now one of the other values of the, uh, of the Matrox proposition comes in how you drive the cards. We, uh, we have a, a utility called PowerDesk and that's what most people think of when they're driving our cards. It's here that the integrator and the, and the user interact with how that card works. Got it here on the screen here, this is the PowerDesk interface and that's set up driving the six monitor array that you can see on the, on the wall here. We're driving two 4K panels you can see panel six there is, is in portrait and the, uh, and the panel five that's in landscape both of those are 4k the other four panels and, the, and the, uh, the, is, you're looking now at part of that uh, that four panel is arranged as a two by two cluster and the white cross you can see in the middle there is the uh, um, is the compensation for the bezels because these are uh, uh, a normal normal monitors with normal size bezels and they compensate it out so that content will disappear behind those bezels now the power desk has got a huge variety of, uh, of uh, other uh, other values for the user. Um, it's here that the integrator would control how the cards interact with the the EDID of the of the screens. It's possible to set it so that the uh, it can emulate EDID, so that even if you're not getting an EDID return from the panel, you can still uh, still set up and use your desktop. That means you don't need EDID spoofers anymore. It's all there in the card. It's here that the users can, uh, can control how the, uh, um, where the windows are going to open, uh, where any dialog boxes are going to appear. So it's, uh, this, is a, this is a great source of value in the, uh, in the card, and it's, uh, it's one of the important reasons why people come back to us again and again to use our cards. The, uh, so the other values that, uh, that users derive again and again from the cards are the long availability and the long life. That means that all the return on investment continues to return year after year. So these two cards, the C420 and the C680, are available worldwide and they're shipping now. 
If you want to learn more, go to www.matrox.com graphics. I'm Rob Moody at Matrox.